And fans turned out for today's game. Despite an initial delay that pushed the game from Thursday to this afternoon, fans made their way to Citizens Bank Park for the first time this year. Our crews found themselves in a sea of white and red pinstripes and a hint of powder blue and maroon as everyone made their way to their seats to watch the game. Count on NBC 10 to bring you everything you need to know from today's big return to the bank. NBC 10's Miguel martinez Vai and Lauren Make have been down there through all this excitement. We'll start it off with Lauren who caught up with fans today. Hey, Lauren. Hey, Jacqueline. This certainly was not what fans were hoped for for the end of opening day, but Opening day is about more than just one game. As I talked to fans here today, uh, they talked about celebrating the entire season, and that is exactly what they did here today. Opening day is just totally different. Opening day at Citizens Bank Park. Yeah, it's my first time. I'm so excited. I think it's like the beginning of spring and then summer, and then it's just, you know, the best time around South Jersey and in the Philadelphia area, so it's great. Fans and the team are ready to go. We were there as the players and coaches, along with the Fanatic, made their way into the ballpark for the first game of the season. Moments before, we caught up with manager Rob Thompson. These fans are really excited. Yeah. They want you guys to win. Yeah, me too. What are you telling your team about how to handle that pressure this year? Well, they've been through it before, and, and uh, they love our fans. Fan base and our fan base loves loves them and it's just a really great relationship between the two. The fans today decked out in jerseys and an array of Phillies gear, loyal and ready. Who's your favorite player? Bryson Stott. Bryson Stott, why do you like Bryson so much? One time, one time I just got a baseball card of him and then I just started to like him. It can be that simple, but the Philly love grows. We went to uh, one of the playoff games against the Diamondbacks and he's been talking about it nonstop ever since. Uh-oh, which game was it? The 10-nothing game. Okay. We were at the good one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. good. Yeah. Does that whole experience, though, last year, does it still sting? It does. Jimmy Fortis says he thinks the team has a good shot at getting back to the World Series this year. Are your hopes pinned on it at this point? They are. Citizens Bank Park, the place to be today. Mayor Sherelle Parker and her son here to kick off the season. When the Phillies win, what does that mean for the city? Listen, it reminds Philly. It reminds us of who we are. Philly grit, Philly pride, Philly resilience. Yeah. Together we can do it. And I'm proud to be here at the season opening to say, let's go Phils! Plenty more opportunities to cheer for the Phillies this season. And because this game was postponed from yesterday, there is no waiting. There is another matchup with the Braves tomorrow, tomorrow, another chance for baseball, another chance to even the score. Live at Citizens Bank Park, I'm Lauren Make, NBC 10 News. Some great interviews out there. The mayor looking good in her pinstripes, the didn't she? The consummate fan, yes. <laughs> Lauren Make, thank you. The fans flooded into Citizens Bank Park before the fight and took the field. NBC 10's Miguel martinez Valle also spent the day at the ballpark. Miguel, what's it like out there this evening now? Well, listen, a lot of disappointed fans, but the excitement, though, the energy, we felt it all day here. The Phillies fans, they absolutely took over South Philly. Take a look as people, a sea of Phillies fans, like I said, a little disappointed, but now bleeding out of Citizens Bank Park, headed home. Uh, they are hopeful, though, for the rest of the season. It was a sea of red and blue as Phillies faithful made their way to Citizens Bank Park for opening day. A family tradition some look forward to year after year. It's just what dreams are made of when you find out you're going to become a mom, like doing me making memories like this. A lot of fans donning new gear for a new season, driving from all over to support the Phils as they took on the Braves. People more than willing to change their plans after yesterday's game was postponed making the most out of that extra time in the city. We had to finagle some things on the home front, well, we but... We got to go to the Rocky Steps, which was really fun. Once they made it through the gates into Citizens Bank Park, the party and excitement continued. People enjoyed music, games, and drinks. Our Philly fanatic also enjoyed himself on the field. After two seasons of postseason excitement and World Series dreams, fans are hoping this is the year for our fight in Phils. The Braves, it don't matter what happens. Once postseason comes, they can't beat us. 
All right, so Tom out here, he tells me he's been to every home opener since 82. You can see they have the sign. Even though we lost today, opening day is still the best day of the year, and that's because there is a lot more Phillies baseball for the season. Go Phils. That's the energy out here. We have to take the sloss and kind of throw it behind us, get ready for this next uh, season coming up. I'll send it back to you. I'm Miguel Martinez-Valle, NBC 10 News.